Tell me a little bit about the upcoming season of Prime Radical. Well, um, it's going to start airing on TVO Kids on September the 5th, starting at 6.30. Um, so it's, it's moved, uh, the, time, the time slot has actually moved uh, from season one. Season one was airing on weekends in the afternoons, and season two is airing uh, weekdays at a 6.30 time slot, which we're pretty happy about because it um, hopefully means that it's, you know, just before or after supper time. And, and we really like the idea of it being a co-viewing type of experience. So kids watch it on their own, but um, also parents uh, watching with the children. Um, and, and we like that idea, particularly because when we focus tested some episodes uh, of season one with parents and kids, um, uh, the first first time we did the series, oftentimes the parents would be watching and it would be like light bulbs were going on over their head or you know, lots of comments like, oh my gosh, I didn't know that. <laughs> so it's interesting to discover how much of grade one and two and three math we forget as adults, you know. So uh, we're happy when parents watch the show or go to the website because it means that they can engage in activities with their kids and, and sort of have a, also an understanding of what the kids are, are learning in school. So Prime Radicals is all about teaching kids math. Yes, in a real world kind of way. So the essentially it's it's three main characters. So it's wacky Uncle Norm and his niece and nephew, um, uh, Alana and Kevin. And essentially Uncle Norm has um, these, you know, he has a workshop where the kids hang out after school. And oftentimes he'll have these dilemmas or problems or something coming up with his very secret hush-hush job. Like the kids don't really know what he does. Um, he's kind of an inventor, maybe a bit of a secret agent. They, they're not sure, but oftentimes, you know, a problem will come up and the kids will go out into the real world to try and find a solution for Uncle Norm's um, problem or dilemma. And that real world solution involves meeting uh, people who work at you know, and do different things in the real world, whether it's someone who works at a sugar bush or someone who's an architect or a firefighter or an artist or a chef. And the idea behind that is to illustrate um, to our audience that math is all around us. If you sort of, you know, look at things with different eyes, you'll see that math is not everywhere and that we're doing it all the time. And we, you don't, you know, and we're all good at it. So we're trying also, besides sort of the real world examples, is to empower kids that they're doing math sometimes without even realizing it. And it's all based on the Ontario math curriculum. Yes, it is. And we're working with Dr. Linda Colgan out of Queen's University. She's a PhD mathematician. Um, and uh, she's been our, you know, content expert for the last um, several years working with us on the both seasons on uh, the development of the website and the content that goes into the website because there's a Prime Radicals website and also uh, this fall winter we're going to be launching some um, games as well um, that can be downloaded as apps or accessed through a browser so uh, we've been really fortunate to you know, find Dr. Colgan and work with somebody whose enthusiasm and sense of adventure when it comes to math really inspired me to have the courage to go out there and try and pitch a, a series about math. Because, you know, on first, you know, on first sort of, um, when you first look at it, you think, hmm, you know, can I sell something that's, you know, curriculum tied, math, children's programming? Is it going to be interesting? And it wasn't until I met Linda and sort of heard her talking about math and the passion with which she spoke about it, that I began to see, oh my goodness, we can do something really, really fun with this, you know, that has elements of comedy and humor and adventure and characters, and at the same time have this embedded educational content. And we're really happy to be working with TDO Kids, of course, because they're one of the few broadcasters in Canada that do um, educational content for kids in this age group. And what's really interesting is it's all set in Ottawa with a local cast. Absolutely. Our talent is um, Ottawa-based. Our crew is Ottawa-based. Um, our writers, uh, everybody is from here, which is fantastic. And, you know, not, you know sometimes, can, you know, feels like it can be a, a bit of a challenge, but it's really um, wonderful to discover that 
you know, we do have the talent here, we have the ability, we have the um, production capability uh, to bring something like this to screens. And of course, you know, our company's been around for a long time, so, you know, we've produced children's series, we've also produced documentaries and documentary series for a number of networks, um, which are, you know, and, and our, our shows are selling around the world, which is fantastic. So it's it's nice to get the recognition that there is a vibrant little production industry here in Ottawa. Well, Hoda, thank you so much for catching up with us today. So season two officially kicks off on TVO Kids on Thursday, September 5th, 6.30 p.m.